Hiya! It's Whimsy and we're back today with a new episode of Mass Effect 3. We are going to continue the Citadel Shore Leave DLC. I'm so excited because last episode was super fun. We did a Priority Horizon and then we started the Citadel Shore Leave DLC and it was crazy and it was so much fun. We did the sushi restaurant attack thing and now we're gonna talk to all our squad mates in our new apartment from Captain Anderson. So yeah, I'm very excited. Let's jump into it. Let's go. Here we go! We have all our squad mates with us. Okay, later when this is over and everything is settled, we are gonna talk about this bait thing. <laughs> What's up, Commander? <laughs> the Normandy's nice, but for unwinding after a mission, you can't get better than this. Mm. Observation lounge needs a hot tub. Hey, Shepard. That is so true. Back during my pilgrimage, I used to walk around near that sushi place and watch the fish through the window. I knew they'd never let me inside, but I think to myself, Someday, when I've proven my worth to the galaxy, I'll go there for dinner. No. And then, you broke their floor. <laughs> Do they even have food you can eat there? <laughs> Not the point, Shepard. <laughs> hey. It is the point, though. <laughs> the restaurant attack has made the news. Civilian casualties seem to have been restricted to... fish. That was a joke. Damn, she looks good. Hello, Shepard. Okay, who else? James. Nothing beats having a Krogan bodyguard. Right? <laughs> Had a buddy like that once. Uh, no, not so much a buddy, really. More of a prisoner who helped us. <laughs> it's a long story, man. Anyway, <laughs> Brooke, she's kind of cute. Think she's on the market? Dude. Shepard. Is there anyone in here? No. Shepard, I've found something. We can gather the team whenever you're ready. Oh my god, her head! That was so scary. I'm compiling data on the gun for Dr. Tassoni. <laughs> she should have the results momentarily. That was so scary! Never do that to me again. I'm glad you made it out of that ambush, okay? None of us saw that coming. But lesson learned. Never have dinner with Joker. It won't end well. Glad you're okay, Shepard. Nice, everybody's here. Still kicking from Grace Sato. Commander Shepard, just want to say how in-depth I am to you, not just for saving my life, but for giving me a greater sense of purpose. After our ordeal security the array base on Antarum, I now know I have something more than my technical expertise to offer. Awesome. I don't even... I don't know. Everything is already placed, no? I don't... I don't know! Who else? Is there people up? Like Garrus and Rex? Oh, hello, Bay. So, what was it, Shepard? Five minutes before someone started shooting at you? <laughs> On the other hand, we get this cool secret hideout to hang out in. Unless the bad guys look in the window. How's it going? How's it going? I don't know. I got shot at. What'd you think? <laughs> Bet you never saw a shuttle get taken down like that before. <laughs> I still got it. Oh, yeah, you do. Thought we were done with all the shooting on the Citadel after Cerberus <laughs> messed the place up. <laughs> they must want you bad, Shepard. Price of fame, I guess. Shepard? Commander, in my cycle, when we fled combat by falling through tanks containing aquatic animals, we usually... Oh, right. We <laughs> never did. <laughs> 
You are a trailblazer. <laughs> Since when does he joke like that? Commander. That's so good. I don't think I've ever heard him laugh like that. It was insane. You're a trailblazer for sure. That's so good. Okay. I'm gonna have to write a report about getting shot. I hear those are really complicated. It's faster if you make a template. I think maybe you get shot too much. I'm watching Dr. Tassoni work. It's inspiring. I'm watching Dr. Tassoni work. I've made some progress. Would you like me to call the meeting? Let's go. Do it. Do it. We have a lead. I called in some favors to run a trace on the gun. It led me to a casino owner named Elijah Khan. He's been suspected of using his profits to smuggle weapons onto the Citadel. Immediately after the attempt on Shepard's life, Khan made an interesting call. Thank you, Shadow I'm Broker. I'm you off. I'm returning your down payment now. What's the problem? Turn on a vid screen. When I sell a gun, I don't want it showing up on the nightly news. You won't be linked to me. Save it. Our association is terminated. And if you even think of coming after me, I've got info on you ready for prime time. So you ponder that. Con out. Hmm. So that's our identity thief. Looks like he's got an ID disguise, Art. Those things are a pain in the ass to get around. Did you get anything on the mercenaries who attacked us? They're a private military corporation called yeah. Cat Six. Okay. As most of Cat you know, Six. Cat Six is an alliance nickname for dishonorable discharges. Many have criminal records, histories of steroid abuse, and other charming features. No <sighs> doubt hired by the thief, not by Khan. That phone call was pretty damning stuff. How'd you get it? It involved the weapons biometric data, Solarian intelligence, and a Hanar prostitute with camera implants. Seriously? <laughs> no, but the truth is boring. Hanar <laughs> prostitute. <laughs> Uh, it sound friendly to whoever that voice was. Maybe he'd pass on that info to us. That I would see take one here in front of my eye. And it's annoying. If he sees you, he'll probably assume you're looking for revenge. Just one The strength. casino has a panic room. Chances are he'll have casino? gone to ground there. Edie can give us programs to hack the door, but ah. the cameras and guards complicate things. Yeah. Khan could disappear. Or worse, if his guards ever open fire, normal people could get hit. I did. She's right. We can't risk spooking him. We go in quiet. Small team, no gunplay. Oh my, oh my, oh my, oh my. Evening, the Who do I bring? Will be hosting a charity event to assist war refugees. Purchase some tickets, Glyph. Then call up a layout of the building. Score. So, how close can you get? You don't usually put a back door in a panic room. This air shaft bypasses the security gate and ends up in storage. From there, the panic room's door camera can be disabled. Still, we're talking about a casino. There's got to be alarms in that shaft. I believe I have some countermeasures that may help. I'll know more once we're inside. Who will go in this shaft? They need to be small in size. Yeah, that's not me. I'm <laughs> snacks of roast veron leg. <laughs> Damn I suspect my suit's built-in tech would be picked up by security sensors. My presence in the casino would arouse suspicion. Mechs are not allowed, since they can have cheating software. What you need is somebody trained in zero emissions tech. No electronics, no metal, just undetectable polymers. We had a course back at Op End, disabling a bomb with these little tweezers. See, the bomb was filled with shaving cream. All right, you're in. <laughs> what? No. What? You said it yourself. We've all got too much tech. But <laughs> I managed to get shot just coming to talk to you. Now I'm supposed to hack my way into a safe room. You're not alone. We'll be backing you up. I was about to see you. Yes. Hit something you can't handle. We'll cover you. If that's settled, it looks like there's one last hurdle to get us inside. Which is black tie required. Oh! Oh! Okay. Who do I bring in black? Garrus for sure. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, fuck. Really? I need to pick only another one? <laughs> I don't know! 
Okay, I'm hesitating between Garrus, Rex, and Tali. Black tie. I kind of want to see Rex in black tie, but Garrus as well, and also Tali. I don't know what to do. Ah. <sighs> I I want to see Garrus in a black tie. I'm sorry. I, I need. I need to see that. But I hesitated. That was hard. <laughs> Big choices. <laughs> All right. Ooh! I'm cute! Ah! <laughs> Looking good, Shepard. <laughs> I did the best I could without a carapace or a crest. <laughs> Your best has my mandible on the floor. <laughs> Damn. You know, I shaved my legs first. Oh, I even put concealer over where I got shot. My God. Just smile and wave, Brooks. That's so good. My mandible on the I'll floor. Get the shot. She you know, does look really good. Yeah. Now put? that uh... I'm here, Shepard. Edie and I will keep in contact in case we're needed. Khan has a lot of surveillance set up. I'd mingle with the guests if you want to look normal. Okay, Garrus. Time to meet the riffraff. That was so cute because he was like... She was like, oh, I did my best, you know, I don't have a carapace or a crest or whatever that is. You know, because she doesn't look like a Durian woman, obviously. But he was like, it doesn't matter. Oh, that's so sweet. I mean, Commander Shepard does have... A really hot bod, let's just say. Garrus, you're so cute! Oh my god, I can't believe. He looks so much slimmer without all that armor, you know? That tie gap, though. Holy shit. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> okay, let's mingle. Come on, bae. Commander, I'm upstairs by the grate leading to the shaft. But there's a problem. Can you meet me? I wanted to mingle. What do you mean? What do you have? Nothing too crazy. I want to be able to walk a straight line. Thessian Temple coming up. Are Asari drinks usually mild? Not all of them. Mr. Khan had us put out some gelatin shots earlier. Also Asari, they kick like a shotgun. Evening. What's popular tonight? Well, some adventurous souls are trying to mind fish. It's what Hanar like to do instead of alcohol. I guess since they're mostly water, the dehydration would be bad. <laughs> right. So there's this fish with hallucinogenic skin oil. Gets Hanar buzzed right up. What happens if humans eat it? Way more potent. And it releases into our system slowly. Best to clear your schedule for the entire weekend. Wow. Evening, officer. Ma'am. Commander. I'm upstairs. I know, but I want to mingle. So, to sum up, tomorrow starts with the Help a Dream Foundation, then it's Blood Drive, Refugee Camp, and Hospital Tour. Hmm. Sounds like you turned pro. I try. Ms. Rios believes we have an obligation to the less fortunate. Of course. So how are you liking the party so far? <laughs> There's a party? <laughs> Evening, officer. Ma'am. Ma'am. Oh, she... Varen Racing? Select one of the four available Varen to place your bet. If the selected Varen wins the race, you receive a payout based on the Varen's odds of winning. Varen with a lower chance of winning, give higher payouts. Attention, bets are locked. Attention, all bets are locked. Good luck, ladies and gentlemen. Wait, but I wanted to play. Upstairs. Whenever you're Come on, Tiger Bite! Bring it home! You get a lot riding on him? He's my boy. Picked him up at his shelter. Whoever let him go had no eye for racers. He can outrun anything he can't outfight, and outfight anything he can't outrun. What are the odds on him? Enough to pay for my kid's tuition. Okay. That's a lot. Oh. Please do not touch the waterfall. 
Okay. Still upstairs. Yeah. Shut up. And round and round she goes. What's that supposed to mean? Is that like code for how wasted I am? Uh, no, Pam. We just call the wheel she. That's sexism. Wait, I mean objectivism. That's sexism for inanimate things. What? I love roulette. Every minute is more exciting than the next. Should I point out the flaw in that statement? Oh, are you like one of those detail people? Come on, even diamonds have flaws, but that doesn't make them less valuable. Miss, where exactly were you educated? Oh, online. You can take these courses and it teaches you responsibility because you do the grading. Miss. <laughs> Miss, what the fuck? <laughs> Roulette, how to play. To start a game, place chips on the following bets. A single number, a range of numbers, red numbers, black numbers. Single numbers return the highest payouts. Range bets return the lowest. You may place up to three bets on the roulette table, at which point the wheel spins. You can place more than one chip on the same bet. Bets cannot be taken back once placed. Price to pay, 500 kids per chip. Press X to place a bet, press square to spin the wheel, if you do not wish to place all three bets. Okay. Um... For real. Wait a minute. <laughs> I mean, we never know. There's no way. How do you even do this? Ten. Like there's... There's no way. How... how... It's pure... Pure luck. Your luck. Like, just waiting. I'm Ashley. losing too much money. Evening, officer. Ma'am. There's no way. Like, how I, I heard your advice you just so good lose money? So, what's going to happen to me in the next few minutes? Disappointment. <gasps> it's oh. Shaira! Commander hey. Shepard. Shaira. No way! It's a long time. My idea of a long time is different than yours, Commander. True. What can I say? I put a lot of living into the last few years. Indeed. 
Do you have any advice for me this time? Yeah. When? Commander? I'm upstairs. Commander, have a drink. I think I once heard a rumor that you were leaving the Citadel. I did leave. Some so-called journalists made up stories about me. Because of their venom, I retired to a little colony in the Salia Nebula. I didn't know that. Why come back? Because I knew people here, and they needed comforting. And because one does not flee the heart of the galaxy in desperate times. Not because of some scoundrel with a video camera. Why, Commander, you keep coming over. What is a lady to think? I was wondering, how does someone become a consort? By understanding the minds around you. By displaying compassion in every direction. And then trying just a little harder, and just a little longer, than anyone who is not a consort can possibly imagine. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a potential client to attend to. Okay. Where's Gears? Okay. Upstairs. Whenever you're ready. Shut up. Mm, my god. Drinks are complimentary tonight, ma'am. What can I do for you? I'm curious. What's the craziest thing you've ever served up? Well, there's the Barak. That's a Krogan drink you set on fire, put out, then drink from the scalding hot cup. Well, there's the Weeping Heart. That's a martini with Drell skin venom. The venom's pretty mild, though. Oh, wait. A Volus Bina. The alcohol puts you on the floor, and the ammonia lets you clean up the mess you made. If you live. Take it up that visor. Why do you have your visor? Come on. Just gonna spend all my time here, guys. Change the music. We need da da dum dum dum. <laughs> A bit more music, like dancing style music. <laughs> ah, there you are. Okay, right, just like we thought. There's an alarm on the grate. We'll have to bypass it. Dr. Tassoni gave me this to pass to you. It's a resonance emitter lens. It should let you see security grids and wiring. Good, I'll follow the wiring to a junction box, splice it and disable the alarm. You know, I heard you were an engineer. Easy to forget with all the uh, shooting. Mm -hmm. The lens is working. Good. Follow the blue wiring. In case it needs to be said, don't try to bypass a camera while you're being watched. Right. I see a junction in the wall, but there's a camera watching it. Shepard, I'm sending a hack to your Omni tool. It will fool the camera, but it'll self delete after a few seconds. Got it. Splice is in. Good. I've got the grate open, and in we go. Act casual. This could take a while. Mingle. Enjoying the party? Oh my god, my Mingle eyes. Party. I drink. Tonight it's rin call on the rocks. Rin call on That's the rocks. Put you down for the count. I just lost a staggering amount of income. This puts things in perspective. You need a few credits for a ride home or anything? Oh no, it's not like that. You know about all those Helium-3 facilities that are getting wiped out? I've flown by a few. Well, to put it in layman's terms, most of those facilities were mine. Oh. Oh. 
<laughs> God damn. Poor dude. Shaira is there, I can't believe. That's crazy. Interesting. You're not mingling and you're not betting. What's your game? The name's Roland Quarn. The game, Commander Shepard, is hearts and minds. Care to elaborate? Most people in this casino are here for a good cause. Others are just here to be seen. Phonies, if you will. They have money they won't miss. Others who are not myself need it. So the honorable thing to do is part them from this money. So you're a con man? Con men leave their marks angry. Con artists leave them smiling. I'm debating whether I should report you to security. Oh, I like a good debate. Would you be so smug if I got you thrown out of here? Possibly. I'd like to see you explain my wicked motives right after you explain why you have a radio in your ear. Well, since I don't see you turning me in either, I gather you're no friend of Khan's. Khan doesn't have friends. Anyone who says otherwise is deluding themselves. So, is Khan part of your game tonight? No, I simply sheer... No. What do humans call it? I fleece his guests. Fleece. Then there's no harm in telling me what his weaknesses are. I've studied him. He's ruthless and rich, but not very bright. Temperamental. Doesn't deal well with the unexpected. Okay. He's also used to letting other people handle things he doesn't understand. Like his security. All right. That's my assessment. Do I owe you anything? No. We do what we do because there are wrongs that need righting. The wrongs I address are simply pettier than yours. Then I guess we know where we stand, Mr. Quarn. Enjoy the evening, Commander. Oh. Okay. That was interesting. I see the security gate. Okay, that's great. But we gotta wait on that until I reach the end of the duct. Uh Oh, there's no way we can go around here. Okay, wait. Distract the guard. Okay. This one. So push my tour of the camp from 1 o'clock to 3. Move from 3 to 5. Excuse me. I think I saw someone doing drugs in the ladies' room. I see. Were you able to identify the substance used? Red sand. Of course. Dispatch, we've got a sand tripper in of the back. Of course, it's red sand. Have they tried to compromise the games biotically? Unknown at this time. Moving to confront. Send backup. We're taking care of it, ma'am. Appreciate the help. You have a good night now. You're clear, Brooks. <sighs> Thanks, Commander. I'll see if I can get to the panic room. Then I'll get back to blending in. Slow and steady. We'll get to Khan. So I can play? Okay. Follow your quickest, meanest Baron on our live virtual feed. Easy on the rain call. Grow a quad to Chunkan Princess and Tuna and Fish Dog. <laughs> I really like Grow a Quad. But Easy on the rain call is also really funny. And it's blue. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bet on that one. Get your bets in, Baron Race. Five hundred. Come on! I almost voted Grow a Quad, by the way. Oh my God, you're kidding. Come back from third. The Princess. Chunkin princess wins. <sighs> wow. Quickest, Tiger bite tastes Virtual like feed. chicken, tuna fish dog, and seasick biscuit! Seasick biscuit is perfect. 
500. And it's an 8 for 1, I think. It's never gonna win. Let's go! Seasick Biscuit! You can do it! No, 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 no! You can do it! You can no! <laughs> Tastes like chicken. Tastes like chicken wins! <laughs> Fuck! Kroger, Tutankham Princess, Tuna Fish Dog, and Tiger Bite. Tuna Fish Dog is so funny as a name. Come on. Oh my god. I have no luck. Live feed. Baron race starts soon. Okay, grow a quad is too funny. I cannot. Nice beans. <laughs> Full 750, and after that we leave. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's so bad. The last one. Like chicken wins. <laughs> That's so bad. I'm losing so much money. Okay. Get your bets in. Five minutes, people. Oh boy. No, no, I'm not. Hi, Elspeth Moraine. I'm running for Zakara Ward City Council. Are you a citizen here? I've had bad experiences with politicians. Yep. Who hasn't? That's why I'm running. I got sick of leaders with ties to terra firma or Cerberus or worse. Oh? The ward needs refugee facilities. It needs security. It needs jobs. It needs everything. And hopefully, with a friend like Elijah Khan backing me, oh. I can make it happen. Oh. What's your connection to Khan, exactly? He's a campaign contributor. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. You may want to do a background check on him. He's dirty, like you can't imagine. Oh, not again. Ah. I can't believe this. I just got done returning donations from some Terminus pirate woman. Was her name Arya? Ah. Yeah, and before that, it was an Asari Spectre Tella something. Ah. Before that, there was this Krogan. Ah. Do I have a sign on my back saying, exploit me? You're me. Well, you don't exactly come yeah. across as formidable. But I'm trying to fix it. I practice glares in the mirror every night. Good luck, Miss Moraine. Poor her. It's for a good cause. For every thousand users, that's a roof over the head of some poor human or vorcha or whatever. I'm all I can't buy that. If I'm not trying to win, where's the challenge? We're taking the house here, like I always say. Each must try to keep then give as much as she can. Um... Talk to me, Brooks. I've got a pressure pad and an obstruction detector ahead. I can't disable them from here. Okay. Edie, I need a tech solution. Brooks, stay put. We'll find some junctions and take down the sensors. Okay. Follow the red wiring. Why, hello, love. Isn't the turnout amazing? I wasn't sure anyone would show up. We pull together when we have to. I feel so bad for the humans. If you need a place to stay or anything, you just let me know. I have a place to stay now, but thanks. So you had nothing before that? Oh, how brave of you to endure, dear. The humans are so resilient. Like that phrase of theirs, stiff one in the lips. Stiff upper lip. Right, of course. Stiff what did that I upper say? lip. Stiff that upper lip. Uh, okay. Uh, disable the pair of sensors. Uh. No, seriously. Have you ever tried to chase an ambulance in a sky car? It's the most dangerous thing you can uh, do. Sensors. 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 Follow the red wiring. Follow the red wiring. Yeah, I forgot about that. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, ah, okay.
I'm in okay, Mr. Tim. There's a camera you in the say car. When. I'll just be here, trying not to cough. Uh. I think I spotted a man in the poker games with a card fabricator. Like a cheating device? Show me. Brooks, try it now. Checking the pressure pad. No alarms. Looks good. Just let me know when that other sensor is down. <sighs> this is fun. Follow okay. the red wiring. Other side. There's a junction by the roulette wheels, but it's in plain view of two guards. But you can do something, right? Because my legs are maybe sort of starting to fall asleep a little. Hang in there. We've got this. Ah, uh, a human. Perfect. I'm kind of on the outs with my human girlfriend. Could you give me some insights? Sir, I am definitely not an expert. I'm at the storage room grate. Time to hit the lock. Be careful, Brooks. I look amazing. Brooks? Olsen. Hey, Commander. What? What happened? Infrared laser hooked up to a silent alarm. I didn't get it in time. Shepard, I'll call the responding guard to say it was a false alarm. But you must stall him before he reaches Brooks. Sir. Hey! Just calm down. I'm trying to do three different things here. Barrels? Sir, we checked out the alarm and storage. It's, it's ED? Not. Minor accident. Find out who tripped it and get them in my office by end of shift. Now you. What do you need? Oh, I'm sorry. Are, are you a security? I thought you were a friend of mine. You got the same suit. You. Enjoy your evening. <laughs> You're clear, Brooks. Thanks, Commander. I'll see if I can get to the panic room. Oh, what is this? It's Kessar! Wait, that's fun though. Select the amount you wish to bet to start the game. The game starts you off with 1-5 points. You may hit for either 1-8 or 4-7 any number of times. The goal is to get as close as possible to 20 points without going over. Yes. I'm good at that one. Kinda. Uh, sure. Woo! Told ya! <laughs> no, no, let's, let's put a... Fuck. That's good. I'll take that. <sighs> yep. Yep, yep. All right. Let's try a bit more. We need to make more money. Woo! I'm too good at that game. It's too easy. <laughs> I'll call you back. Potential client here. Enjoying the party? Like adrenaline in my heart. They're gonna have a fire breather on the bar later and shoot fireworks oh. above the ward. Okay. Would fireworks even burn in a vacuum? It worked at New Year's. Whatever they did, it looked freaking nuclear. Uh-huh. So are you Khan's lawyer? I represented the casino once. Brutality suit. What's Khan like? Intense. Scares the hell out of his staff. But every now and then, he does some charity, like this. 
Does that make up for it? If what I hear about him is true, not remotely. You ever think about working for someone a little more above board? Like who? The Council's gonna need lawyers like everyone else. You think I should defend the Citadel Council if they get sued? Who said anything about defense? <laughs> Okay. We're done. All right. Okay. So now I think you just need to get to me. I'm on the other side of the security gate. Right. Have you bypassed the camera back there? Well, I got my side. Yours is still on, though. We need to finish this before someone comes by. Hang tight. I'll get to you. Follow the yellow wiring. Yeah. I can't get the security gate to open from here. The junction must be on your side. It might be tricky, just so you know. Have a little faith. Excuse me, I couldn't help but notice your side on. Is that a corn effect? Yes, sir. It is. Uh... Okay, but this dude sees me, that's the thing. You have a good night now. I'll get his attention. You say Can me. you tell me who can the I'm afraid that's confidential, but I'd be happy to provide you a free drink instead. You have a good night now. <gasps> shit, shit, shit! Suspicious activity. My floor. A guard spotted me. If you act normal, hopefully he'll move on. The thing about Solarian parties is, they all do it too well. I don't follow. My lab group on Sirkesh. All Solarians but me, and all with damn near perfect memories. Oh, that could get awkward. Exactly. It was all about who burnt the cake six months ago, or arguments the two people continue when they meet up once a year. So they never let anything go? Yeah, it was constant one-upmanship. I couldn't keep pace with them if I wanted to. Bartender hides the hard stuff, like say Turian Horask. I'm sorry, sir, but we aim to entertain our guests, not put them in a coma. You have a good night now. I think I spotted a man in the poker games with a card fabricator. Like a cheating device? Show me. All right. My God. <laughs> Khan, I'm not here to threaten you. We need to talk. He's dead. No? What the hell? And here I had this bad cop routine. <laughs> Is he dead? Commander, there's a deletion order on the terminal. Damn it. Everything's been wiped. I don't know if it was him or the killer or... <gasps> when I tripped that alarm, did I screw this up? What are you looking for? Mistakes. Thought so. Whoever it was had to do this fast. They wiped the terminal, but not the comm. Huh. Oh, so we can take the comm back to the safe house to scan it, or... Elijah, come crawling back? Guess again. You. I see you've recovered from flopping on the floor like a fish. <sighs> You'll need to do better than that. The last guy that trash talked to me was a few kilometers taller than you. <laughs> Brave. I thought as much, but it won't matter. You have nothing. All you can do is wait for the hammer to fall. That's so good. <laughs> Sovereign. And I guess the hard binger as well. Well, we didn't we didn't get 
rid of our binger. That's so good. Little sovereign. <laughs> you need more than that. Bring a bigger hammer. Your last try was inadequate. I'm gonna take everything you have and everything you are. Uh huh. Damn it. <sighs> Sorry, Commander. There wasn't enough time to trace the call. We're not finished. Pull out the data drives. Uh huh. The ones that got wiped? You think we can find something? With Edie, anything's possible. The sooner we get them to her, the sooner we can track down this threat. Hell yeah. <laughs> that was so funny. The last guy I trashed on Hell of a was a few kilometers well, taller than you. Unless you were the host. Didn't end so well for him. It wasn't a total loss. Brooks, so he was with Edie to see if there's anything useful on those drives. Here's hoping. I'll let you know what we find, Commander. All right, then. <laughs> Damn, Commander. He can't even attend a party without okay, someone Okay, we got credits. Now, if I can just find some chow around here, you'd think a pad like this would be stocked. Shepard. I could go for some food while we wait. Too bad you shot the hell out of the best sushi place in the city. <laughs> What's up, Commander? Shut up. Did I ever tell you about my casino run-in with the Vorcha Mafia? 5,000 credits and a bottle of whiskey? Actually, never mind. What? Hey, Shepard. I want to know about that. What the hell? I hope Brooks and Edie can find something on the drive. Same here. Hey. Greetings, Commander. I hear it was quite the party. Even if things didn't go exactly as planned, at least you didn't come away empty-handed. Commander? Sounds like the mission ended with a hiccup. Well, I'm just glad our team made it back okay. Edie will get it done. Yeah. There was a light. Don't I have a message? Weird. Edie will get it done. Fucking weird. <laughs> I'll keep the dress, I think. Everybody's too cute. To borrow a phrase from Vega. God damn. You look smoking in that dress, Shepard. You got some looks. So did I, though the ones directed at me said, how did a Turian <laughs> like that get a girl like her? And the final. <laughs> Garrus. How's it going? Garrus, stop it. It's smoking. Ooh. What's the matter, Shepard? Didn't want me as you <laughs> <laughs> Too much Krogan for you to handle. I really hesitated, Rex. A lot of people have that problem. Most of them. Are dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <clears throat> I hesitated though. Commander, instead of infiltrating the casino using a disguise, it would have been better to hold all the primitives hostage, threaten them with death, and shoot them until they gave you what you wanted. Next time, I will gladly assist. <laughs> yeah, I sure you would. Commander. I'm sure you would. Goodness gracious. <laughs> this is so much fun. I think we've got something, Commander. Commander, okay. Edie and I have been analyzing those drives. I think we found something if you're ready. Let's get moving. Let's hear it. Though the data's root structure was erased, the logic integrity remains viable. Edie has an incredible talent for this stuff. I know she's an AI, but even still. We found an encrypted communication from a few days ago. Just need another minute to crack it. A whole minute? Edie here could shave that down to five seconds. I thought it best to allow staff analyst Brooks a chance to improve her decryption skills. And now you've lost your chance to show off. Like she needs it. You're the crew of the Normandy. You're legends to the rest of the Alliance. 
Legends can be good or bad. Which are we? You're the kind that people look up to. The kind they owe their lives to. But how come everyone's always shooting at us? I think it's mostly you, Rex. The bigger the target, the bigger the... Uh... Target. <laughs> You're saying I've gained weight? It just means there's more of the legend to love. <laughs> And the camaraderie, the friendship. I think that's your secret weapon. <laughs> it was mostly me, as if I would say it's that. It's all just part of the job. I need to do a renegade Wait. run. Job? You mean the rest of you are getting paid for this? Here we go. Wow. Those marks who were after you, they bought a lot of weapons. Like, big ones. Max. Max. What do they need with that kind of firepower? <clears throat> It appears this drone is preparing to rebel. I have just monitored the Commander's <laughs> Spectre access code in use at the Citadel Archives. Punch it up. The Archives are going to emergency lockdown. Where is hacking your records is there right now? What do we know about the place? Council keeps sensitive historical information there. Real hush-hush. Even my old CSEC clearance never got me in. Then we'll find our own way in. Gear up and let's... The fuck? Is that pizza? What's with the volus? Oh, pizza delivery. <laughs> it <Very> is! <laughs> Double pepperoni. <laughs> These archives are huge. You'll have a lot of ground to cover. Shame you can't bring everyone. <laughs> Who says we can't? All hands on deck for this one. Nice. Hell yeah. But, uh, who gets to take point with you? Ahem. <clears throat> Ahem. <clears throat> <laughs> Who's going to pay the bill? <laughs> this is too good. I love it. Who goes with me? Okay, I didn't take Rex last time, so let's take him now. And, um... An archive? I feel like Liara would love it. Javik, maybe? Edie? Garrus, obviously, but... Everybody's gonna go anyway, right? Archive with a lo lot of hush-hush information. So as a shadow broker, I feel like Liara could... Uh... I'm gonna get back this one. <gasps> I can, can I cycle your appearance? I can't. Okay. These two. That's a cool shot. All fucking right. Why don't I have my Black Widow? Thank you. My Locust. Hell yeah. And my Carnifex. Hell yeah. There we go. Then for you guys. We want the Claymore. More damage. Spare shot capacity. And current effects. Power damage. Liara, current effects with power damage, I think. And... the Locust. Obviously. Power damage. There we go. That's pretty good, no? The new must be the, um... Suppressor. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. Alright. I am very excited. I am very excited. Five points... Well, we'll put in barrier. We, we won't have any more po points. There's a lot of enemies. 
Oh. The facility is located below Hell the wards. Yeah. Maybe a direct breach for maximum surprise? I like it. Sounds like you're learning the ropes. Hell, hang out with us long enough and you'll learn ropes, knives, bombs, <laughs> Treasure <Dresher Sure>, Moss. <Mom. laughs> don't hang out too Toro. long. Toro. Crazy dog, you'll be making friends. Harvesters. Uh. I heard that. <laughs> The archives are somewhere below. Damn, us. she looks good. It could be pretty tricky to get in. Rocks, I mean. Not really. That a bomb? Yeah. Not really. First. See you at the party, princesses. <laughs> That's like the citadel. Uh, it's a lamp, but it's in the shape of the citadel. It's pretty impressive. Is cool. Hell to the fuck, yeah, dude. Ah! Not this again. <laughs> oh, stimulant pack. Specially designed up survival pack that triple increases survivability and all damage output. What am I equipped with? Use your claymore, please. Okay. Oh. Love it. Okay. Come on. Where do you think you're going, princess? Where the fuck is she? Oh, she's invisible. You mess with Shepard, you mess with me. <laughs> Well, That's enough. <laughs> Thank Drop you, Rex. <laughs> this won't end well for her. You bitch. Fuck. All right. What the fuck? <laughs> That's me. Whatever you think you're getting away with. It's a clone. There's nowhere you can run. Nowhere you can hide where we can't find you. Hide? Why? I'm Commander Shepard. I never hide. I told y'all! I think it was in the first episode. Uh -huh. So that's how it's gonna be. She doesn't wear the same thing as me, it's fine. We can differentiate. What the fuck are you? Who are you? You weren't the only Shepard that Cerberus brought back to life. But at least one of us will finally do something with it. I called this. I f I'm fucking proud of myself. I fucking called it way back. I think first episode. Isn't it first episode of this fucking playthrough of Mass Effect 3? <laughs> you were relatively successful. Who's that? Did he make a new me or Enough something? Talk. Liara. I'm pretty sure they remade me. I'm, I'm sure Cerberus remade something like a, a second me with the Lazarus Project number two or something like that. But this time with implants in the brain, so they can control the new Shepherd. Like I'm, I'm just guessing, but that would be fucking insane. I called this. <laughs> of course they did. <laughs> I thought, I thought that um, in retrospect. I thought, I think it was Kai Lang, but I thought it would be a clone of me. But then it was Kai Lang, so I kind of like forgot about that. So they put a control chip in her, is what I'm guessing. Like she doesn't have all my personality and everything. Oh, that is freaky though. Where did you come from? I'm proud. The same <laughs> DNA as you. A clone. Cerberus spared no expense resurrecting you with me. I was created for spare parts, in 
case you needed another arm or a heart or a lung. Where have you been this whole time? In a coma. Until I woke up six months ago. While you were in a jail cell on Earth, I was learning to be human. Okay. Amazing what a person can do with enough neural implants. Okay, I see. So yeah, it doesn't have a personality. It's really just a robot, basically, but with my DNA. There's only one Shepard. I don't care who you claim to be. The role of Commander Shepard's already filled mm -hmm. by the wrong woman. It's time the understudy had her day. That's dangerous. Did the elusive man send you? No. He abandoned me when he had what he wanted. You. Then why are you trying to kill us? Because I don't have her memories. I'd never fool my supposed friends. The ones who abandoned their duty to join the cult of Shepard. Like you, Dr. Tassoni. You're nothing more than a college cheerleader pretending to be a soldier. How dare you! And you're just you? a pale imitation of the real thing. Oh, thank you, Liara. I'm the real thing. Perfected. I'm you without the wear and tear, Shepard. Doubts the failures. I'm the lone wolf you were always meant to be. Without the emotional baggage holding me back. No one will ever believe you're Shepard. They will when I'm flying her ship. This is Shepard. Initiate Normandy lockdown. Transmitting command codes now. Good idea. Too bad the signal was blocked. Trainer, this is Shepard. Prep the Normandy for emergency departure. We're leaving. Oh, she's gonna I'm die the bad. Command codes now. You're gonna die bad, girl. We'll get underway. You're going to die. Never thought I'd say it, but I'm looking forward to killing myself. <laughs> I guess <laughs> ominous threats of violence run in our DNA, but mine is more than a threat. Execute them. The cult of Shepard ends today. Let me think. Cat six heavy. We still got everyone. Okay, no, 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 no. Come on. Oh, shoot. There we go. Team Mako. 
Oh, this is too good. I'm screaming. I'm, so I'm sorry, guys. It's just so exciting. I fucking called it. I mean, it was obvious that this would happen, but still. I can't believe I fucking called that. Way back. <laughs> Way back, like, a couple of first episodes. I don't remember. Goddamn. <laughs> this is insane. It would be very dangerous if she... If, if she really succeeded, though. For real. That would be really dangerous. I'm sorry. Alright. Oh boy. Huh. Big place. Mm -hmm. Shepard, what do you think your clone is looking for in here? At this point, anything's possible. You mean like strolling along and bumping into your clone? I don't want to talk about it. Of course. At least not till we've all had a drink. <laughs> Liera was so cute though. You're just a pale I imitation. Find in this place. Glyph? Yes, Commander. No. Track the target. Give me updates on its location. What is the nature of the target? She looks like me. Then I have found the target. <laughs> no, Glyph. It's another me. Now get going. At once, Commander. <laughs> Glyph. Team Mako. Mako, I'm sorry. Team Mako. How are you doing? Is Garrus Team Mako? Is there stuff here? No. A Lancer. M7 Lancer. A Lancer! Yeah, yeah, the, the assault rifle, right? Look at this. It says this gun was part of the first contact war. Year 2157. That was... Uh, we had that in, uh, in Mass Effect 1. Wow! That's so cool. <laughs> Love it. Yeah, back when humans and Turians were at each other's throats. Yep. Commander, the other you is searching for something 200 meters ahead. Guys! Fighting your own clone. Who would have thought? But useful. If there is a task you don't wish to do, Commander, let them handle it. Yeah. So, like a personal butler? I don't want to talk about it. Yes. So let your clone do it. Yeah. Oh, shit. Dagger squad, I need more time to reach the vault. Keep shut. Burn off my back or I'll have your head. <laughs> All right. Maybe we can circle around them on the two. Oh shit, oh shit. Oh my god, Rex. Understood. You mess with Shepard, you mess with me. 
That's so sweet. You mess with Shepard, you mess with me! Uh. There we go. There we go. Am I missing anything? I don't think so. Defend Team Mako. Oh, 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 oh. shoot something once when you can shoot it 46 more times <laughs> he says the that on my uh... can't be far keep up the pressure and we'll try to surround her let's move on my uh, plushie of of him <laughs> he says that <laughs> unlike the tag oh it's so good this is pure fan service but like really well done Done in a really good way. Year 2157 CE. First contact war. Turian interrogation. Vault T91. Sir, we captured this human in the occupation of Shangxi. A human. You're the first I've met. And you're the first bird I've met. He was armed with this weapon, sir. How primitive. Your kind expects to win a war with this. A bullet is a bullet. You have so much to learn. And when we conquer your Earth, I look forward to teaching you. Wow. I wish we could see more of that. Is there plans on making a game? I don't know Andromeda is set when, but is there plans on making a game with like the first contact war? I'd be fucking down for that. And like how it got resolved and everything. That, that would be... I would love to see that. I think if you read the first, not even, the first book is already after the first contact war, no? I want to know more about, about that. I don't know. Imagine the history in this place. It must stretch back thousands of years. I just wonder what the other me is looking for in here. Year 700 CE, Krogan Rebellions, Attack on Council, Vault K-306. This is the only visual record of Krogan Overlord Kredik's attack on the Council. Audio follows. I've heard enough. If the Krogan hadn't taken on the Rachni, you would all be at their mercy. You won't give us what we deserve, and so you force us to take it. We will never leave the planet of Lucia, no matter how much the Asari cry. Ambassador Kredik, you only weaken your case with a show of violence. Wrong, Solarian. Now our case is finally strong. Negotiations are over! Oh. Damn. Go, go, go. Malfunction detected. Oh, nice. Please contact me here. Malfunction detected. Malfunction detected. Please contact me here. Well, fuck, I wanted to know. Function detected. Please contact me. This is Hammerhead. Enemies ahead, Shepard. We'll get their attention. Someone can try. Right away. I 
see how it is. Ooh! It didn't die? Are you kidding me? Oh, there was two, maybe? They're hard to cool. headshot these ones, for sure. You know that I think we got them all. Or, I mean, the rest of you did. Or, the Krogan did. Yeah. Hammerhead and Mako keep pushing ahead. On it. This termination action is unlawful. Why do you continue when our appeal has not yet been heard? Keep quiet. You know that the Council will never overturn its own edict. Standing by for your go, sir. Do not terminate us. Go. What was that about? Exciting. I love it. <laughs> that laugh is so good. Malfunction. Malfunction. 2183 CE, Battle of the Citadel. Yeah. Dreadnought attack, Vault X5. Yep. In the opening minutes of the attack, you'll see that Zakara Ward is almost completely destroyed. Interrupting. Spectre status recognized. Commander Shepard. The following information is classified. The unknown aggressor is suspected to be a Reaper aided in its attack on the Citadel by rogue Spectre Sarah. The Reaper Sovereign is destroyed by the Fifth Fleet. That was cool. Where do you think you're going? Uh, attention, low life mercenary wannabes. Say please, and we'll accept your surrender. Say please, please, and maybe Rex will take a break. Uh, and we'll see. Your next one's Shepard, you back with me. Makes no such promises. <laughs> attention, enemy drones. Please cease hostile actions. <laughs> I believe we could benefit from a mutual exchange of data. Additionally, the term Broken Butler does not encompass. Uncle Ergot has a present for you! This is too good. I cannot deal. That had to hurt! Commander, I have cataloged 18 previously unknown historical events. Where's the target glyph? She is searching for a secret vault. She did not wish to be disturbed. What? I thought she was you. Go find her again. Oh my god, glyph. Sorry, glyph's not a combat model. Aw, that's so cute though. <laughs> It's kind of cute, though, I gotta say. Ooh. This is such a good DLC. This is pure, pure, pure fan service, but well made. Having all the squad, you know, like... <sighs> it's always like this. You start a mission and you wish you could bring everyone because you love everyone. You don't want to let anyone behind, you know? And now for once we actually have everyone. Like, that's crazy. That's so nice. I love it. Ooh. 
Nothing behind the crates. Oh shit. Atlas on the walkway. Team oh. Miko here. Got him in our sights. Team Hammer right here. Fighting with our support. Hey, but Explode. <laughs> For sure. I need ammo. Like, it's so good to see them all like this. Commander, a large contingent of soldiers calling themselves Razor Squad is just ahead. They wish to inflict bodily harm on you. Also, I discovered an Elcor mating totem in Vault 347B. Fascinating. This is too good. Oh my lord. Kidding me right now? Shit, Rex. Oh, my God. annoying <laughs> I mean you were dead for a second there ahead. but yeah right. I might throw up a little bit now if that's okay with everyone yeah I wish I could listen to all the dialogue that they're saying because it's so funny but I just wait I could have went there oh that would have been good but you know it's in the action and everything so it's kind of hard to listen to everything 
It's so good though, I can't wait to uh, to edit this. This is gonna be really fun to edit. All right, boss fight soon. Eliminate target. Elcor mating. <laughs> I can't even. Commander, the other you wishes to pass on a message. Shepard, save yourself the trouble. Once I have what it's I can, it's so weird to hear myself. Anymore. Now go, drone. Deliver it. Your 710 CE. Krogan Genophage. Deployment. Vault T101. Yeah, that's we the, have the shroud. The of the against the Krogan has been authorized. Not by my government. Your government invented it. What good is a weapon if you don't use it? Sergeant Tavis, restrain him. Are we sure of our orders, sir? This is genocide. Sergeant Hout, restrain them both. I'll press the button myself. Wow. One day, Solarian, you will thank us. Dispersal commencing. And more than single-handedly fixed it. I mean, we helped, obviously, but... What the fuck is going on? of using 30 civilians as bait to flush out and assassinate your target. I knew they'd survive. Probably. You're being released. The Council wants you to implement a new special tactics and reconnaissance group. Desk job? No, thank you. This is no desk job. Spectres will be the best of the best. They will operate with impunity first spectres. and answer only to the Council. You will be the first. Now that sounds like the best job offer in the galaxy. Help me in. It's not a death job. <laughs> the next person who says that is fired. It appears the other commander has a back and temper. Collateral damage does not concern her. Oh, come on. Oh, my God. These scientists perished. I would like to have discussed the Elcor mating totem with them. Origin Earth. Early religious artifact, Vault E28. I don't see what it is. so good okay uh where do i oh 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 ammo oh i'm full okay sorry um uh, should i go here didn't i arrive from here i did right Pretty sure I did. Didn't I? I am lost. I'm... Oh, no, I arrived from here. Okay, sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I was a bit confused. It's all good. Got Team it. Hammerhead, we're headed to the next level. What's your location? Garrus is Tim Mako, Hammerhead, is what I understood, by the way. Because he keeps... I, I saw earlier, and also he keeps talking like... Oh, There's Team Mako is we'll so much out. better. Hammerhead's gone ahead. Showing Hammerhead how it's, how it's going, or... How it's done. How it's done is the right word.
Oh, that's not fun. <laughs> that ain't good. You mess with Shepard, you mess with me. Oh shit, I saw. Wait, oh my god. Right here. Uncle Er Erdnot has a present for you. Uncle Erdnot. First time seem harmless but unable to communicate. Preliminary observations First time suggest that their role seems to be that of some sort of guardian. We will begin our exploration. Damn. Am I missing something from... No, I arrived from there. <laughs> I'm sorry. The archive is... Uh... Team Mako, we're coming up behind. What's your status? Making me lose my mind. Mako, where are oh, you? Oh, shit. Under fire. Under attack, whatever. Your 2183CE. First Human Spectre Deliberations. Vault SH-1. Commander Shepard's recent accomplishments are not in question. It's her background that the Council has no knowledge of. Shepard was born on Earth and orphaned at an early age. She managed to survive on the streets until she was able to enlist at 18. Anything from Shepard's military record that you'd like to call out? Many in the Alliance consider Shepard a war hero. On Elysium, for example, Shepard single-handedly repelled an attack and saved the entire squad. Thank you for your presentation, and to all who spoke. The Council will render their decision on the suitability of Commander Shepard as Spectre within the day. An Come orphan on copy. the streets? What's your status? The other you is jamming our radios. Hammerhead and Mako are trying to get ahead and cut her off. But I've been hit and need help. Please, hurry. Well, shit. Is there anything here? <laughs> I need help, please hurry. Yeah, but let me loot first. E yeah, no, let me loot. Okay. Let me loot. Shit. That can't be good. Trap. The vault sealed us in. Is there an override? None that I can see. Cortez! Brooks! Do you read me? Is anyone on this frequency? The short answer is no. They're not. I'm glad it's with the Black Widow. The Finally. The answer involves your friends the right trapped weapon. in medium vaults and forgotten for... Would have headshotted well, you. forever. Others know about this. About you. The Alliance will stop you. What do you think, Staff Analyst Brooks? Will the Alliance stop us? I wouldn't know. I don't actually work for them. Yeah, she was too naive. It was... Uh-huh. Uh-huh. You're gonna die. Who the hell are you? So I can and do you end really you. think I won't track you down? <laughs> My name doesn't matter. I never keep the same one for more than a few days. Oh, wow. And if the elusive man hasn't found me yet, you never will. Your Cerberus? Was. Mr. Elusive and I didn't see eye to eye. He's indoctrinated, whereas I prefer the whispers in my head to be my own. Interesting. Why not come to me? We could have worked together. 
In a way, we did. I'm the one who put together all those dossiers on your suicide mission. Wait, really? The collector base? There was the Salarian Doctor, the Asari Justicar, the Drell. They were all mistakes. We were a pro-human group who started looking to aliens for help. So I bided my time. And when I found another you who agreed, I woke her up. What was the point of it all? All we really wanted was your Spectre code. I got Shepard. Spectre access accepted. But then you survived the hit and insisted on bringing your damned Asari into it. So I had to tie up loose ends. The arms dealer. Elijah, it's me. We need to talk. What the hell's going but on? She was... I swear, if those guns get tracked back to me... They won't. But then your sex bot just had to go and recover the data. Sex so bot? Excuse me, Edie? Forced to contain the situation. I will end you. I will end you painfully. The minute, the second I get out of here, I'm gonna take your head and mount it in Normandy <gasps> CIC. <laughs> then I'm gonna mount her head next to yours. <laughs> Then I'm gonna take both your heads and space them out the airlock. Uh, I'll help. That sounds very dramatic. Uh, and if someone like, say, Commander Shepard made the threat, I'd be worried. But you're not Shepard. Not anymore. This is too good. You had Miranda, I have her. Mine has more bite. It was fun while it lasted. But what does she want? I don't understand. What, what are you doing? Typical villain Setting to explain. Right. Remember this? But not making any sense. You were the first human Spectre, Commander. This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. Except somewhere along the way you forgot about your entire species. You've saved more alien lives than you have human. They all matter. I don't care what species they are. Every life counts. But maybe a clone wouldn't understand that. <laughs> you know the one thing they can't duplicate? Our handprint. Life gives it its shape, not DNA. Which is a problem. Computer, update council records. Subject, Shepard, human specter. Accessing record. Please input new data. Biometric identifier updated. Good day, Commander Shepard. Now, if you'll excuse me, the Normandy needs its captain, so, uh... I should go. <laughs> That's not how she says Farewell, it. Farewell, Commander. I guess... That's not how she says it at all. Go to die. Oh, my lord. I'm gonna end you so painfully. I'm gonna mount your head on the bridge, you see how? And then Refresh out of the memory. airlock. Didn't we used to win these things back in the old days? She said I should go. Do I sound like that? No, you don't! As long as I've known you. No. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Maybe we should be worrying about the impregnable vault we've been sealed inside forever. <laughs> I see much gooder things. I'm more confident than she is. More in control. Uh. With me, it's more like that's all for now. Exactly. Spoken. Like a Krogan. Yep. Show him who's boss. Yep. I doubt there's enough air in here either. An hour at most. <laughs> Sometimes I'll talk to you later. Because, you know what, I never do. Yeah. Even want more. Yep. <laughs> Shepard, why aren't you more worried about this? <laughs> hmm? Oh. Glip, you still out there? <laughs> yes, Commander. <laughs> Unlock this damn thing and go find the others. No one steals my ship. Not even me. I mean, I mean, we kind of did. We kind of did. Stole it for ourselves in Mass Effect One, <laughs> thanks to Captain Henderson. I mean, we got <laughs> that was so fun. She she does not sound the same. I got room for Shepard plus two, and figured out fast because the other Shepard is stealing my ship. Ugh.
This is so much fun. I cannot. Shepherd plus two way. Eh? I don't know. I kind of want to keep Rex. Again, he's too funny. He's too funny. He's so good, and I don't have him the rest of the game. You know, I never have him. So I kind of want to keep keep Rex. You know. And it, he's so fun. Rex and Garrus? Yeah, that's a good squad. That is like the good old days Mass Effect 1. That is a good motherfucking squad. What? I was hoping to come. Oh. Yeah, I, I never seem to get back. <gasps> Joker will come back for you, I promise. They know! Are you kidding? I feel so bad! <laughs> I didn't think they would realize! They have broken the fourth wall! Oh my lord! Well, shit! <laughs> I never get big! Oh why my I god! Hate shortly. I swear you parked the ship for five minutes! <laughs> Can you contact Citadel Flight Control and get them to deny the departure request? Tried. All the comm lines in the area are jammed. Probably to make it easier for them to steal my ship. We'll stop them. Even if we lose the Normandy, we can go to the Council and prove you're the real Shepard. No. She changed the logs to make her biometrics the official ones. Yeah. We can't prove anything. Yes, that. Can we all just agree that it'd be easier to not let Shepard's evil clones steal the Normandy? We'll stop her. One way or another, we are taking this bitch down. Damn right. Go kill the crap out of you. One way or another, I'm gonna okay, get Citadel you. Okay, Citadel systems are targeting the car. You, get you, get Any you, closer and they open fire. We're taking this bitch Get down. back and pick up the others ASAP. Right, they can't have gotten far. Unless they called a cab or something. Joker will come back for you. James Vega was like, I never get pick. I feel Good. so bad. I needed to kill something. I can't pick everybody. Retake the Normandy. Yeah, let's fucking go. Okay. Um. Okay, wait a minute. Oh my lord. Jesus. Let's get down. Okay. This. Well, <laughs> well. <laughs> Thank you, Rex. <laughs> oh shoot! Oh. Come on. 
he equipped with? Yeah, he is. Gonna fight in the Normandy. And I don't even. Wait, what? You were just on the Normandy. You, you fired me. Dishonorable discharge for conduct unbecoming. You kicked me off the ship with barely enough time to grab my toothbrush. Not the fucking six hundred credits toothbrush. <sighs> That's a Cision Pro Mark IV. It uses Mass Effect fields to break up plaque and massage the gums. Yes, I told you that. And I remember because I'm the real shepherd. Mm -hmm. And someone just threw me off the ship. If it wasn't you. A clone. Shepherd's got a clone. Makes sense when you think about it. <laughs> I could explain more later. For now. Makes sense when you think about it. Does it though? <laughs> I mean, it does. It does. It's sealed. The engines are online. They're about to take off. Is there anyone still aboard who can help us? No, I was only there because I helped with the Normandy retrofit. Yes, done, done, done. Everyone else is um, on shore The engineers, Don, Kenneth, and uh, Kenneth Donnelly, and uh, oh my god. Okay, you know the ship inside. No, now. can you get me them? inside? Kenneth There's an and emergency exit hatch for evacuations. It should be right here. Manual lock, and it's only meant to be open from the other side. Any ideas? From this side, a very precise mass effect field, maybe. <laughs> You're kidding me. Are you kidding me right now? If you told me this morning that a toothbrush was gonna save the Normandy, <laughs> I'd have been very skeptical. <laughs> there is no way. There is no way. Okay, it, it was worth 6,000 credits, wasn't it? 6,000? Oh my god, dude. That's so good. <laughs> I love this DLC. It's the best thing ever. Uh. Ma'am, just before takeoff, Normandy registered a perimeter access alert. One of the security hatches. Her. Where? Unknown. When we shut down the AI, we disabled a lot of security systems. Shepard could be anywhere on the ship. Shepard is Right, ED is not in control of the ship. Are we clear? It's better this way. Wouldn't you rather take her down yourself? Armory, find her! Slow her down. Yeah. About that. 
Now it's our turn to crawl in there, just like Joker did in Mass Effect 2. Pretty sure we broke Trainer's toothbrush getting the hatch open. Remind me to reimburse her for that. <laughs> 6,000 credits. I'll make a note credits. of it. <laughs> a little cramped in here. Quiet. Can't risk them hearing oh, us yeah. up top. A little cramped, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Get off my tail. <laughs> All right, get a patrol going. Find Shepard, the real one. Hey, what you mean by slow her down? We're allowed to kill Shepard if we have to, right? She said slow her down because she thinks we're cannon fodder. Oh, uh, well, shit. Because you are. Watch out, they're here in the CIC. Get over here! <laughs> I am getting hit. Real Shepherd, I need you to lock down the Normandy. Can you help us out? Edie, do you copy? Edie is she's out. Got problems of her own. Let's get to the cargo bay. All Cat 6 long range specialist. Primary weapon flexible accounts. All right, snipers. Management heard LRS Bell's complaints about having to go with a standardized loadout instead of customizing your gear. So here's the deal. You can either take a standardized loadout or apply for a flex account that gives you an annual stipend to apply towards new weapons, upgrades, and maintenance. Your call, but anyone who goes crazy with mods and blows off their own foot off with a high explosive ammo is SOL, like LRS Bell. Credits in your flex account expire at the end of the year, fiscal, not calendar. Also, LRS Bell is no longer fit for service. We'll be passing the hat for anybody who wants to chip in for a you shot your foot off card so we can send Susan off to retirement with a smile. What? <laughs> Private Campbell's favorite favorite mug? Okay. <gasps> send this to an animal shelter for proper disposal as a warship is not an appropriate ho ho. That is not okay. That is not okay. She messed with my hamster, guys. <laughs> now it's personal. <laughs> guys, were you gonna say something or? No, no, I get it. Hard to even find the words. Should we check on my fish? Because if she's getting rid of all the pets, <gasps> we should probably deal with her first, huh? <sighs> all right. Sit tight, little guy. <laughs> Anybody gives you trouble, go for the eyes. <laughs> All right, sit tight, little guy. Anybody gives you trouble, go for the eyes. Oh my goodness, that's too good. I love it. Should I check on my fish? So, anyone want to talk about their people's history? Nope. So I'm the only one who misses when we used to chat in the elevators back on the city. I I miss it too, nope. Garrus. So disappointed. No, I miss it too. I loved it in Mass Effect One. I got so much lore out of those elevator rides. <laughs> <laughs> lore and and love for you. Oh my lord. 
Oh, with the N7 armor. Damn. Red though. Well, that's Ooh. creepy. <laughs> well, that's creepy. You want to stop shooting up my ship? It's not your ship. It will be. I've taken your name, your Spectre rank, even your fingerprints. And then you left me to die. Only I didn't. You think fake fingerprints are gonna fool the council or hack it? Hack it would never be fooled. Anderson? Nah. How's that big plan looking now? <laughs> Ooh! Hatchet squad to the shuttle deck. Brooks and Clone. Accept that. Hell to the fuck, nah, dude. Cushina. Plan B. The hell is Plan B? Shepard, this is Vega. Do you copy? Over. Shepard here, Vega. Brooks. Sorry. 
Uh... Oh my god, dude. Regenerating, so I, I don't know. Maybe I just need to survive. What the hell's going on up there? Get us out of the nebula and jump to FTL. We can't. A sky car keeps blocking our path. <laughs> I'm joking. Shoot it. It's not gonna work. Within 30 degrees of the nose to block course plotting. That makes us a perfect target. No, that makes us the bait. Do you want me to drive? No. <laughs> We're killing thousands of innocents right now. Maybe hundreds. Damn it. Okay, dozens. Blow that thing out of the <laughs> sky. <That's too> <laughs> Not the shuttle. Watch out! That door's still open.
taking the Normandy back. And honestly, I'm doing you a favor. Because you don't have what it takes. Is that like infinite medigel? I think it is. Wear blue. <laughs> I'm gonna have to convince my you. squad mate to help. What makes you so damn special? The right person. Why you and not me? Hang on. Oh, they we know. Huh. Wow. Thanks. What about this pie jack? Save or kill? I kind of want to kill, but... Huh. I kind of feel bad for her, but also... Kill. <laughs> you. Nah. Get off my shit. Yep. I said I would kill you. Bye. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry, but nah. Nah, 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 nah. Nah, she wouldn't have had a change of heart suddenly because Brooks, or whatever her fucking name is, was, like, not her friend anymore. Fortunately, they weren't here nah. long enough to do much real damage. Although I may need some help from not James cleaning it. up the damage to the shuttle bay. Plus, they overloaded the heat diffusion <laughs> system so firing at us. Not sure if you noticed, but shuttle guy here did some crazy stunt flying to keep us in one piece. That's nice to fly something a little more maneuverable than the Kodiak. What about Edie? Is she back online? I am once again fully in control of the Normandy. Nice. <laughs> Glad to hear it. What, what about the Mercs? Any survivors? Just one crappy ass pilot and her. Alliance has taken her to a high security facility. Maybe she can give them some dirt on Cerberus. Oh. I'll be more than happy to cooperate with the authorities. I want to kill you. Until you escape. Me? Escape? But I'm not a field agent. Stop. Just stop. You betrayed me and the Alliance in oh, the shit, middle shit, of shit, a shit, war. Shit, 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 shit. I was young and naive. Admit it, Commander. You'll miss me. Not at this range, I won't. <laughs> uh, maintenance to the shuttle bay? <laughs> no way! Did we just kill her? <laughs> Not at this range, I won't! Wow. Oh, that was too good, dude. That was Rest too good. Squad's waiting outside. We'll have the Normandy back in shape in no time. Oh my god. Wow. <laughs> I told y'all I would kill you. <laughs> that was so good. Appreciate I'm sorry, it. but that was that was so good. I, I wish Well, what happens on shore leave stays on shore leave. Oh yeah. 
Is that the end of the DLC? Maybe we can take some actual time off. Oh my god, I've been playing for way too long. Just us. Don't know about no explosions, but just us sounds perfect. Ah. The music. Sorry about that, guys. The dinner is ready, so, and my family's going crazy. <laughs> fighting an evil clone, you know what comes next? A nap? Please, we party down. Well, I gotta get going. Thanks to settle up before I head back to Tuchanka. Always fires to put out when you're in charge, Oh, right? but it was so nice. Let me know if you want to hang out or if you're having that party. See ya. Party, huh? Party? Well, no pressure. No one's gonna make you throw a party. All right. Good idea. Let's I need to stop playing, though. But I've channeled discretionary for funds next into your account for the purchase of any celebratory supplies, Commander. Oh, hell yeah. Okay, Edie and Cortez and Trainer are in. What? I have also informed Dr. Tassoni about any potential upcoming celebrations. Wait, wait, I am in charge of the guest list. Yeah, so there's no uninvite button on this thing? <sighs> All right, but when it's time, I invite the rest. Cortez just invited James. So... Fine. Everybody, I'm gonna go out and open see how house. Much trouble I can get into without snapping a femur. <laughs> Members of your crew have expressed interest in spending time with you, Commander. You can check your private terminal for messages. If you require activities, Silver Sun Strip has an arcade in addition to the casino. You have also been granted a complimentary pass to the combat simulator. <gasps> Thanks, Glyph. Guess I should take advantage of some shore leave myself. Amazing, amazing, amazing. War assets, Normandy repairs. Wow. Alliance frigate, frigate Normandy SR2. Credits. The whole shebang. I. <laughs> Damn, we really played Renegade today. But I mean, it was too good. It was too good. But I kind of wish. To see what would have happened if I didn't do that renegade interrupt. But it was so funny. It was so funny. Not at this range, I won't. <laughs> I love this game. It's amazing. This DLC. Holy shit. It is pure fan service, but it's so good. You know what I mean? Pure fucking awesome fan service. Really enjoyed it. I mean, I played two hours and a half almost, so goodness gracious. But um, thank you so much, guys, for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed as well, and I'll see you in the next episode. We'll, we'll continue. Uh, we'll continue. I mean, Citadel party. We can go to the arcade. We can go to the combat simulator, and then we throw a party, I guess. So there's still many things to do. So yeah, we'll continue that next episode. But yeah, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!